What's going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to be installing the Momentum firmware for the Flipper Zero. I had a live stream where a subscriber um, recommended me using this firmware. They said that uh, Xtreme is pretty out of date. It's no longer supported. So I was like, all right, well, I'm going to look into it. And uh, I figured I might as well make a video of my experience uh, installing the firmware. I'm pretty sure it's going to use like the web base like most of these um, firmwares uh, do now. They don't longer get like a download application to move the files over. Uh, you should be able to just do it in a Chrome browser here. Currently running a Windows 10. Um, I am uh, using uh, a Chrome for the browser here and uh, we're going to go through the process. So I'm going to leave the link to get to this page where you first start the installation in the description. So I'm going to leave that link in there. So that's the website right there. Um, and uh, we're going to start the process. So I'm going to um, hit the install button. All right, it's telling me to connect. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to head to connect our Flipper Zero. I plugged it in. It's showing up right there. We're going to click on it. Connect. All right, and as simple as just hit the flash button. All right, so at this point, do not unplug this. Anytime you're doing a firmware update on anything, do not unplug it. Just let it do what it needs to do, and uh, I'll get back to you uh, once this is uh, almost done. All right, I just wanted to show you guys what it looks like when you update your flippers. You can see the screen come on and off, on and off, on and off a couple times. Just let it do what it needs to do. When it's done, it will let you know. So when it does this process, just understand that this is a normal thing. Just wait until it says it's done. Just be patient. Again, all the on and off, on and off is completely normal. So this is what you should be seeing. You're gonna see the stuff, you're gonna see that nothing's loading here, and now it's just sending it all to the flipper. So just let it do what it has to do. All right, we have done it. It has loaded successfully. Now I haven't had a chance to um, actually use it yet, but it looks very similar to Extreme, so I'm really excited. And I got to keep all the dead set graphics. So there is the firmware at the time of this video. That is the version is right there so we did it It was literally that simple these web installers are, and uh, firmware installers are so nice it's so simplistic it's way better than how it used to be back in the day so uh i can't get anything to focus but thank you guys for coming to this video um i'm gonna give you a review later on uh with this um, firmware like i said this is the first time i've installed it myself we did it uh, i'm basically live here on this recording uh so whatever troubles i ran into i didn't I actually ran into no troubles at all so uh, I look forward to looking at this um, firmware for a Flipper Zero, and I will get back to you guys. I'll let you know how it is. But again, thank you very much for stopping by. Remember, safety is an illusion, and I'll see you in the next video.